Hey, this is Eric Pasley, and today I'm going against the box. <laughs> I feel excited going against the box. I've never gone against the box before, so I'm curious to see what's inside of it. The box. All right, here it is. Inside the box. Your songs are so positive. What keeps you hopeful? Knowing that there's hope at the end of the tunnel. I think it's just, uh, I try to make sure to look at everything good that happens in a day, and even though it might all hit the fan, at least you had a fan that it could hit off of. Uh -oh. What was your, this is really happening moment? Uh, this last year I got to record Deep As It Is Wide with Amy Grant and Cheryl Crow, with Vince Gill behind me asking if the guitar part was good enough, and I was like, is this really happening? So that was pretty cool. Are you really as innocent as I think you are? Maybe. Or maybe not. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> that was a fake gun, but I... What other singer would you trade places with for a day and why? I'd like to change places with Johnny Cash so I could know what it feels like to kick out the footlights. These are all so random. <laughs> what kind of conditioner do you use in your beard? It's all natural. <laughs> Are you supposed to use conditioner in your beard? What is the funniest song you've ever written? One that's not appropriate for anybody. I'm kidding. <laughs> I don't know. I think the funniest song I ever wrote was called Lucky. And I was probably 15. It was right when I was starting to figure out how to write songs. And it was about a Winnie the Pooh pinata at my camp, and we all wrote a song called Lucky and talking about how unlucky he was. That is the funniest song I think I've ever written. <laughs> <laughs>